All right, so somebody, you're dealing with a psychopath, motherfucker. This person trying to keep your life stagnant. Um, it's something dealing with your, your healing journey. You're going on some type of journey where you're healing, you're growing, spiritually evolving. And somebody is getting very offended by it. They want you to shut up. They want you to stop bringing up things in the past that you went through, that you healed from, that possibly involved them, okay? And I don't understand it. If if, if they did it because it made them feel good and it happened to them, why can't you? They want you to just get over it, but they need to just get over it too. The fact that you hurt it and you healing from it. They need to just, get, just how they want you to get over it, they need to get over it and let you heal and stop listening to you and stop motherfucking watching you because now it's seeming like they're obsessed with you they're stalking you you understand what I'm saying it's one thing you to be watching somebody and not saying nothing but to steadily be watching this person and commenting it okay you need to stop you need to fucking stop wiretap nah, you need protection this person wiretapped you you need protection I wouldn't trust it okay conspiring against you they're trying to conspire against you by wiretapping you so that means they don't got nothing on you that's against the law that is against the law because of black magic so they're going to sit up. They presented your work as theirs. So they're going to sit up. You see how this the manipulation going on? This is manipulation. And they're doing black magic on you. They're provoking probably you. Practicing spell work on you. I keep seeing it. Queen of Pentacles. I just said what I said. Where did it just go? Gaslighting pretty much. I just seen that. Anyway, they getting offended. Somebody wants you to keep reliving past memories, past thoughts and shit to get you triggered. These people need to get dealt with. I'm tired of these psycho. This is a psychopath. This is a fucking psychopath. This full moon is going to have them reveal their true intentions and feelings. Yeah, watch out, I sense a scam or a trap. Somebody got an STD too? They could be saying, you have an STD? Somebody is also going far down in your records and shit, trying to just catch you up on anything, anything. You about to get a new lover as well too. Whoever you going, they trying to blackmail you. Whoever you dealing with, they got ties into people in, in places, in, in places, okay? High places. They all about to get kicked up out of that shit. Offended by your healing journey, taking it personal. They want you to relieve, relive old tragic moments, memories. Okay? Give it time. Don't let it rush. Because whoever you are, you, 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 whatever going on in your brain, they know your mind is a powerful motherfucking situation. It's something powerful going on in that motherfucker. So be mindful you don't got no mad scientist trying to come and get say some bullshit to you talking about you got brain cancer or you got this, you got that to try to get a biopsy of your motherfucking brain to try to text you out and get scans and all that. Just be mindful because that's how far these motherfuckers be going. Because they're trying to figure you out. And they need to figure their own motherfucking life out. And figure out why the fuck they do what the fuck it is that they do. Look, take caution, black magic. They didn't pay people high up, high up to do spell work on you. High, high ranking, dark art spiritualists and shit to do spell work on you. You know it. Your feelings are your superpowers. Because some of the you got a, scam, a scamming, they love her, is a karmic scammer, and they trying to take over your business because they know you are powerful. Your mind is powerful. Your feelings are your superpowers. You got a very good intuition. Your mind is something fucking strong and powerful. You know it's about to be a division or a breakup that's coming. Because God favors you. Come on now. They try to divide to conquer this megalomatic. I know what the fuck I'm talking about. Somebody wanted you to be a SEX slave of theirs. And it ain't happening. 
you dirty cheap motherfucker following you trying to have you clone my reason don't usually go straight like this but this might even be a movie we gonna say it's a movie so this shit sounded too <laughs> yeah this is what these motherfuckers do though huh they clone tyrone they clone tyrone or they try to trusting your intuition take caution they wish you was him or her. <laughs> oh, weirdo. They really wish you. Yeah, come on now. And they bitch know it. They person know it. Conspiring. Trying to harm you. Misery love company. Playing like game. They know it. So they trying to take you out. Trying to take over your business. That's weird, bruh. That's really weird. I don't care. That's really fucking weird. Somebody has went way too far with this shit. They were scared you was going to take that spot. Very soon you will be celebrating a big win. That was from my last reading. I couldn't finish that shit because that shit was... I'm tired of this shit. I'm sick out here in this world. I swear to God they is. Bruh. And they be trying to, try to get you caught up and get you go to jail. The same motherfuckers that be trying to get you caught up in some shit. Sick than a bitch. How you going to try to get me caught up in that? But when you over here, you sick bitch. You need to be under the motherfucking jail. You need to be under that shit. Protected over they fucking heinous fucking acts. Strike a match and observe the the, the smoke. If it travels up, the energy is clear. If it travels north, trust your wisdom. If it travels south, healing is needed. If it travels east, healing is passing through. If it travels west, tune into your emotions, okay? Anyway, are y'all there? We ain't laying no match right now. <laughs> Some of y'all can't. If you feel that someone is messing with your energy, relax in the comfort that they have no idea who is protecting you. And I'm looking over there. I need to light this candle. If you feel that someone is messing with your energy, relax in the comfort that they have no idea who is protecting you. Some of you guys got some hell of some motherfucking ancestors protecting you. God, the most high. If you don't know your ancestors, you know they protecting you. Some of you guys got people higher up protecting you. My last reading, I was saying this person that's harassing you don't even have the authority that they think they have. They just get over on certain people that are puppets. They don't do their job. They don't ask questions. They don't investigate. We all can ask questions. We all can investigate and go a little deeper. They just going along with shit. That's how you get. If you fall for anything. What would he say? If you stand for nothing. You'll fall for anything. Okay. Just falling for any fucking thing. Oh loopsy daisy ass motherfuckers. They don't even know who's protecting you. Because there's somebody that's watching over their ass. And watching what the fuck it is that they doing. They need to stop. Let me go light this green candle. I didn't see the flame, y'all. I didn't see the flame. It was lit, though. Because I thought it went out, babe. It wasn't lit. Just because you don't see it. They don't see it. You have no idea. It's still lit. It's still going. Don't, dang, that was... <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hey, anyway, we still motherfucking here. Just because you don't see it don't mean nothing. Okay? Come through, spirit. 
Comfort spirit. In my ass for sure thought. I'm like, hold on, they just motherfucking went out with me. Let me get a spiritual card day. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? I scared me all the love. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. What's going on? They fucking with you though. They are messing with your energy. Doing spell work on you. Conspiring against you and shit. But relax in the comfort that they have no relax in the comfort that they have no idea who is protecting you. They have no idea. And that could be why they going so going so heavy on you. Because they don't know who's protecting you and how you getting protected the way that you are being protected. Whoever you are, go ahead and treat your body well and enjoy your music. You might enjoy music a lot. And these motherfuckers are confused. Didn't I say they're trying to figure you out? Whoever you are, you are a, a healer. You are, a, I meant to say a teacher, but you could be a healer. And shine brightly because whoever you are, you stand out and be proud of it because you, you are an individual. You have, an indi you have some type of indiv individuality that is very unique okay very unique and you need to answer your calling whoever this is is trying to make you not answer the call but you need to answer that call don't let this person scare you or stop you because again they don't even know what's they fucking confused on who's protecting you somebody way higher than them i don't give a fuck if it's the highest level of security they see, they see, and they know that God is something else protecting you. And some of you guys, it's the highest level of some type of security that is fucking protecting you. Okay, now I was about to start. Spirit, give me a card then. Remember who you are. What you feel is right there. I'm going to pick that up in a second. Remember who you are, your culture, your resilience, and your beliefs, and staying strong in them. You know who you are. And if you don't know, Spirit want to remind you. Okay? Remember who you are. You see that animal behind them, too, her, too? And you see these people walking around with the animal. On they, remember who you are. They could be talking shit about you. You could be in tune with animals. And I'm not saying that you know ve vegan or vegetarian. But you in tune with them. You're very much in tune with them. Okay? If somebody don't want you going after your goals. They don't want you to persist. They're not, uh, man, they don't want you to persist. They don't want you to have encouragement. They don't want you to have courage. They don't want you advancing. Because they know you are someone that is powerful. And it is some things that, but if, if I was them, I would stop messing with you, especially if I know that you are protected by something that I have no idea about what it is that you are protect. They're trying to figure you out, but there's nothing to figure out because God said you, you are to be left fuck alone. It's clear as day you ain't up on nothing evil or bad, but they keep trying to conspire that against you. Somebody is keep trying to make it seem as if you're doing bad magic, dark magic, black arts. You're not. You're fucking not. It's just because they don't understand what it is. They never seen somebody do it how you do it. But I guarantee you, especially if you're wiretapped, they didn't listen, they didn't hear everything it is that you were saying and doing. And they know ain't nothing evil about what it is that you motherfucking doing. So why is it that they're still trying to conspire against you? Like, it don't make no motherfucking sense. Just give me one more. They don't want you connecting with your past loved ones. They come about lighting candles and they eat. Motherfucker, so why do you light a candle for a candlelight visual when someone passes away? Why the fuck do you do that? Why do you light candles around your house? It's all an energy situation. Shut the fuck up. Just because you don't know, and I'm so sorry to anybody that might be an orphan or don't know who their parents was, but just because you don't know who to pray to and you're still a little confused, don't be mad at me. Y'all praying to shit that... You're having a hard time to get back to basics. 
simplifying, reducing, and creating. Centering yourself. Somebody fucked with your energy. They threw you off balance. It's okay. Spirit says you might want to start journaling, writing. Reconnect with Mother Nature. The shirt I had on yesterday it said, listen to your mother. And it had the world. Start listening to your mama. Start listening to your mama. That's who protecting you. Mother Nature is protecting you. Your mama. The mystery of her. How she came about. That's what they need to be studying. This motherfucking world. But instead they ain't y'all up in your motherfucking ass. But they didn't realize you part of the world. You part of Mother Nature. You tapped in with her. You her child. Anyway. They don't want you to have these dreams of abundance. At all. None whatsoever. They don't want you to. They feel like what it is that you do and who you are, you should not have abundance. Okay. It's this wealthy man, though. I'm hoping maybe it's a wealthy man that's doing this. Look at this. This you see this standing up was right here and say all you got to do is show up. You might be being protected by a wealthy man or this may be a wealthy man that's doing this to you because he has a lot of money to sit there and listen to you. He didn't wire type your ass. That's what that is. Back in the day when we had no TVs or radios and shit, we had these little tr transmuters that would type out the words and shit of what, what was being said. He didn't wire type your ass. It's something way more advanced that we can't see. And we know it's probably embedded in some shit. They tapping in, though. They listening. Oh, they motherfucking listening. And you know they listening. They listening through any type of electronic that they can turn on or tune on or whatever. They listening. It don't take a rocket scientist to see I can see that shit. What you don't see, there's a brand new opportunity that's coming for you. This wealthy man might be handing you this opportunity, this job. He might even be handing you over some money, child. So he could have even paid these people to do luck income. And look at how these cars is fucking. The oracle says you are due for some luck. It is recommended that you boost your income and blessings. Okay. What is going on with this two of swords and this? Queen of Pentacles, she keep coming out, child. You so Queen of Pentacles and Nine of Pentacles, it don't make no sense. <laughs> Y'all like, what? You're very grounded and about your money and very self-sufficient. Okay? You, you done worked hard. So it's time for you to enjoy the fruits of your labor because this is your garden you standing in. You see all them fruits and shit? Okay? You done did the work. You're very intuitive. And I said you got a connection with animals. Animals might love you, always be around you, insects and shit. Someone sees you not in the partnership. You don't got nobody. Ain't nobody helping you. You was dealing with somebody that was the king of pentacles in reverse, though. But this motherfucker was a scammer, schemer, finesser. What did I say in the beginning? What did I say in the beginning? Y'all don't be hearing me, though. This person want to help you. They may want to work with you. It's something you don't see that is coming to you. Again, you don't see it, though. You don't see it. My last three, and I'm going to have to chop that shit up, though. I said, you don't even, you didn't even know about this position, though. You wasn't even caring about the fucking position. You don't give a fuck. <laughs> you didn't give a fuck. You're like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's the end of a relationship. Somebody see you not with somebody, and whoever it was that you was with was very karmic as fuck. Very karmic as fuck. Somehow, some way, they could have been making money off of you. Some of you guys, you don't even know this. This lover, you guys, is with the one that was broadcasting your business, exploiting you, and it got to a lot. It, it spread to a lot of people. You went viral, unbeknownst to you. But some of you guys, somebody went viral on the fucking dark web. I don't know where that came from. Emperor in reverse. There's some type of abuse of power and authority. The devil, they wanted to take this opportunity away from you. They knew you was about to get your... Their wishful fulfillment was you 
not getting this opportunity because they wanted to say you was devilish, you was evil. But it ain't gonna happen. They were just abusing their power and their authority. Then I say somebody wants you to be so dark, so motherfucking bad, but you not. You're fucking not. fuck is wrong with this bitch three of swords in reverse it's time for you to heal get up, that, get up out of that heartache and pain you may have been working from a place of hurt lately but it's time for you to heal and come up out of that shit yeah I'm trying to tell you you hurt you wounded but keep moving forward keep moving forward we know you hurt whoever you are you hurt you wounded we all are not we all, I ain't everybody not, but you know, you, you're not the only one, trust me. You're not the only one, so keep moving forward because you for sure got some type of opportunity that's coming to you. You may not see it, but it's here and it's coming to you. It's fucking coming to you. What is this? Stay humble and hustle hard, okay? <laughs> What is coming to you? Somebody want to say you evil because of how you match energy at times. So fuck, so what? Sometimes that love and light shit don't be helping because motherfuckers take advantage of it. If somebody holding to a lot of secrets. Somebody could have even rejected you in the past because these people said you don't have intuition and again, you're doing dark arts to get your intuition. But it's shown otherwise. The fool, you free as a bird. There's a lot of stalking and watching going on. Somebody's obsessively watching and stalking. They didn't come up with some crazy plans to get this opportunity taken from you. You got people grouping up that don't have no intuition. They're trying to steal your intuition and prove that they got intuition. The fuck out of here. Chariot, you will have victory and success over this. You're going to be riding off in the fucking sunset, happy as hell. Somebody been lying. They ain't been telling the truth at all. They could even say you had a mental illness. You're mentally ill. The fuck out of here. This person now is not in the source energy from the lies that they didn't tell. Hey, the source. Somebody me mentally is fucked up. Somebody's fucked up mentally for trying to fuck you up. They could even been doing spell work on you and that spell work then bounce back on their ass. Somebody's living in a mental entrapment, having sleepless nights, nice being paranoid and possessed by what it is that they didn't did and told. Because they realize ultimately you ain't fighting, you ain't in competition with nobody. You don't really give a fuck. What's this King of Swords in reverse? Three of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. So you will get the help and the collaboration that you need to get your wish for, wish for fulfillment. All while this person was trying to work hard again to get their wish for fulfillment as far as you missed out on this opportunity. But it's going to come. It's going to come regardless. You got a, a real man, emperor, that's about to give you this offer. And it's in your best interest to take it. Last reading there said divine to conquer. Like somebody's literally trying to d divide people up so they can have, but while they divide these people up, they're going to try to be cool with each party and each side. You know, they think they're about to run some type of king. That's how that shit get burnt the fuck down. We ain't in them whatever centuries ago, motherfucker. Sit your ass down. We don't run off of them type of norms, don't motherfucker more. Because people see what's going on. Nigga, it's you. Acting like you not with that, but you is with that. Then run over here acting like you ain't with it, but you are with that. Sit your eyes down. We don't fuck with you at all, nigga. Because we see you, we see right through you in your bullshit. What is this? That shit not cool, bruh. Motherfuckers need to just beat themselves and just let shit. Let me shut up. What is really going on? Hey, the cubs. Somebody's going to have to walk away. They will, from all the rumor and the gossiping, overindulging, they will not have a victory and success in this. It could be. Anyway, they, they need to go. They need to leave you the fuck alone. They need to leave you alone. Somebody didn't do a lot of mirroring. I already said it because I already seen it. It said, because you the empress, child. They can't, 
they cannot be you. They cannot manipulate you. You understand me? They can't duplicate that. And I say all them bitches grouping up, trying to be you, do spell work on you, to copy your energy. The emperor can do what all them five bitches can do. It's really about three bitches with the three of cups in reverse. A cancer could be the head honcho of it all. It don't got to be. But, but uh, that mirroring energy, trying to mirror you, trying to duplicate you, copy you, clone you, it ain't working. Something is not working out. And these people about to go through a spiritual revival. Not revival, but like a spiritual judgment. And it ain't going to be good. It ain't going to feel good. Hangman in reverse. For whew, Anyway. For not accepting the way, accepting things for the way that they are. Whoever you are, you loving and you caring. And you're here to help people, heal people from their past traumas and hurts. And they're going to be ashamed of regret. For what they didn't try to do by keeping you out of this loving commitment, loving energy. Or a commitment. It could only be a commitment. Strongly could be a commitment. <laughs> the secrets is coming out. They could even took a whole lot from you. A whole lot. You may have not even known what was all that was coming to you. Somehow, somewhere, these people got away with stealing from you. A whole lot. A whole lot. What is this? Somebody could have even stole a business from you. Ruined the business. Got had in the business taken down, shut down. Obsessively stalking your ass. Somebody needs to heal. Somebody needs to heal. Somebody, it, it's a cancer and a Virgo in here as well. Somebody needs to heal. They coming up with some plants that are not good. Not good at all. They ain't already did. Ain't nobody watching and talking. We got the taste. What? Court case. Somebody's a traitor. Things are about to get in alignment. God has the last say so. Somebody could have fucked with your car. The chariot in reverse. Somebody could have even been fucking with your car. Child. God has the last say so. Somebody is a traitor. Somebody could have even did something in your car. Put something in your car. To spread around. To fuck with your taste buds. Um, somebody could have fucked with your car alignment. You might be having issues with the car. Y'all, what is going on? Because the chariot is for sure a car. Somebody could have even did some things to take over. They wanted to like take possession of your car. Ownership of your car. What's really going on? Thieving and stealing. Somebody could even try to steal your car from you. Through like ownership. Title exchange or transfer. Something of that nature. The proof is in the pudding. Didn't I say you helped heal people in the child? Heal people from childhood wounds. But they said you was a fake spiritualist. They learned your routine. Because I said they stalking you. They watching you. They stalking you and they watching you. Using you as a pawn or decoy. You block this person or you need to. They're trying to block you though. There's nothing wrong with a little reassurance. They're for sure talking behind your back. Could be an Aquarius. Someone could have used an Aquarius to steal a car from you. The damage is done, too. So I don't even think there is no, um, no reviving this. They may be asking for a revival, though, but they about to go through a spiritual awakening for what it is that they did to you. Somebody has stole somebody's car. Somebody high up wants you to be a slave. I said that my last year, and they want you to be an SEX slave. The smell. It's something going on where somebody could even mess with some chemicals. Pay people to do some chemicals or something with the black web, dark dark web. Okay, it could have been twenty thousand that they stole from you. They could even pay somebody twenty thousand because they said you was pure evil to fuck with your car. Whoever you are, you're loyal though, and you don't deserve this shit. This full moon gonna have them reveal their true feelings and intentions. It's about to be an unexpected change. Cause this person's about to go broke too. They going broke for what it is that they did to you. All right, I love you guys so much. Take care. Somebody could have even did this to you to see how much money you was going to have. Fucking with you, stalling your energy. Somebody trying to see if you got more money than what you do have. 
they said you've been stealing and Steven and stealing to get money and opportunities and buy things. All right, I love you guys so much. Take care.